So yeah, now we've got Curly assisting us. And if I remember correctly, if you traded for her machine gun, she still has a machine gun here. So I was like, wow, you had an extra and didn't want to just give it to us? Oh wait, no, she doesn't have a machine gun, never mind. She has the Polar Star that has, but uses it with the same firing pattern as her machine gun right now. So that's a bit evil. So that's what I, where my confusion came from. Do I even have any ammo for the missiles? I do. Get out of here, armor gaudy. See, yeah, that's not a wig, that's just straight up armor. Okay, max fireball, now I just need to level the missiles back up. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, land back- oh, fireball's missed. Let's grab all of these. Alright. Ow. Okay, this god is gonna be a nuisance. Take it- oh shit, I missed. And that was my only missile. Shit. S seriously, stop. Stop this nonsense. Okay. Freaking take it, there we go. And he just gave me missiles. Of course he did. Hey, uh, 20 damage. Edge for missile now. These things have 50 health, apparently. Let's just take out all those. I'm more worried about my Polar Star's level than my missile's level. Oh, Curly finally... He learned the Mega Jump to get it back over. There we go. Ah, almost fell right into the spikes. Definitely don't want to do that. This curly just decimates hates that critter. Ow, shift. Of course, I did that. Wow! Seriously, take this guy out! Oh, Curly. Alright, let's get some more shit. Ah! Great, I only... He made things worse by attacking that guy. Alright, let's refill the... F okay, let's not refill the fireball. There we go. Oh god, I'm at 13 health. But I definitely want to save my a freaking thing life pot. Cause holy crap, this upcoming king boss is ridiculously hard. Let's grab all those. Hey, no, jump. Pressing the button to jump! Huh, I expected some of the EXP to land up on that platform, but it didn't. Oh, there we go. Missiles finally max EXP. Okay, good. Everything's max. Let's get rid of that thing. And that guy has a large enough hitbox to get hit from down here. Or from up above. What? What just happened? How dare you? Alright, let's take care of that guy over there first. So I take the so I rotate the slow right around to get back to the polar star. Okay. 
I guess I just already grabbed the XP to refill it. Nope. Not good. Deal. Okay, I really want this health. I really want this health right now. Even if it means risking drowning, oh no. Okay, who? I'm safe. Shit. Yeah, if you run out of air, you die instantly. So, don't run out of air. Yeah, I don't really care for that guy. Or any of these, for that matter. Come on. There we go. Got him. Press the button. Press it. Goodbye, Curly. She was never seen again. Now nah, you can just drop down. Hey look, a teleporter. I wonder where this leads. Yay, this one's now working. Teleporter seems to be working now. Of course it just leads somewhere else in the labyrinth, doesn't it? Yep. Hey Carly, you're back. So yeah, we're not going to use that save point because... We don't have any way to fly back up to that teleporter. So, whoopsie daisy. Uh, no, don't fall down. Get back up. Get out of the water. So, yeah, I guess I just wasn't close enough to hit them with the blade there. There we go. Pick up well, I just killed the big guy instantly, huh? I'm about to take all this health and missiles. Am I doing 10 out of 20? Yay! 14 out of 20. Ow, shit. 15. Give me that 1 EXP. No, oh, no, 1 EXP was not enough. There we go. There's probably just a, a health station on the other side of this. Nope. Can't get through here, we'll have to keep moving ahead. Alright. Well, at least I'm at 18 out of 20. Weird place, eh? I wonder if this was some sort of base. Huh. Open shutter? Yes. Opening shutter. Abnormality detected in shutter number four. Rude. Well, I like how 4 is the only one that's labeled. This shutter is only made halfway open. Looks like it's caught on something. Huh. Here, let me just shoot it loose. You hear something? Give! <laughs> I... Mari Davis. Like, I... I know how to... I know how to use guns, and that is my... And that is my only trick. Ooh, problem I don't know how to solve? Shoot it! Like, thanks. Very simple robot. With very simple solutions. Shoot it. Ah, oh, but this one's invulnerable to shooting. However, will we get by? Just shudder after shudder. All the security makes me wonder what's down here. Don't you think? Yeah, it's 
a strange place. Lower lift, lowering lift. Lift lowered. So yeah, let's go through this water and not drink them. Open shutter? Yes. Opening shutter. Strangely, Curly doesn't move from that spot until she goes off screen. So, that's interesting. Anyway, save right now. I guess I probably expect this to hear sound rushing water from within. Weren't for the grating, you'd probably get through. Yes. Save right now. Right fucking now. I swear to god, this is the hardest boss in the game. And, yeah, before you do anything, because we skipped Booster, something is coiled around the broken robot's arm. Will you take it? Yes. Got the tow rope. So, yeah. The tow rope is only here if you don't have the Booster 0.8. It. So there's three important items if you want the true ending to this game. And Tow Rope is one of those three. The Tow Rope for Robots. So yeah. You And you have to collect it before beating the boss here. Our broken robot. Severely damaged. Look, this is a soldier from the surface. It's all banged up. There's a ton more like it, too. What on earth could have... Not an Amiga. No. To do this much damage. You don't say that's not an Amiga. Still alive! <laughs> Team 9 annihilated. Failed to destroy target. Current forces insufficient. Retreat. Retreat. And it's exploding. He knocks out Curly. Oh shit. Yeah, you definitely want to dodge those projectiles. And now look how close they are. And Curly is awake because we've gone through one rotation. And now the water's coming in, so now so our mobility is greatly re reduced. Shit. Shit. Of course, as soon as I swap over to the blade, I immediately take damage. Oh shit. Run, because it's going to be doing those projectiles after blowing you back. Ah oh shit, of course I just jumped directly into that. I don't even know what damaged me right there. Ah oh, fuck, I didn't jump in time. Just, I can't even reach it anymore. Oh boy. Just shoot with missiles. Shit. Get out of the way of those. Of course I fell down. Why wouldn't I? No, why would I jump? Oh, well, I'm still on the platform. As Curly gets the finishing blow. We did it? Humph. <laughs> Pulled it off, I see. You! You know what? You tossed me down here. Let's try it Better be safe. Ha! Be silent. You're no mother. Do you even know what this is? What? Huh. 
This is what I hate about robots. This is the heart of the island. If you stop it, the island will fall to the earth. Is that your grand plan? Take the, take the island down with you in a blaze of glory? Fools! Hey, what are you doing? Bring the core to the laboratory at once. There's still time. <sighs> well, shit. No, I fell. Alright, back up here. Curly, what are we supposed to do? There's too much air. Wait, other way around. Too much water. Ah, uh, Curly, save me. Your sense is dim. The world grows dark. Did you know that the witch woman Jinka once had a brother? His name was Balos. Like a sister, he wielded powers far beyond those of mortals. You got an item. You can breathe. Curly's air tank. Allows for underwater breathing. Curly gave it to you. There's no reply. She isn't moving, but it looks like she's still alive. You used the tow rope. Yes. Tied the rope to her body. So strangely, yeah, we can... We need to breathe, and apparently we can take medicine like pills. It's weird. We're strange little robots. I mean, but I guess they will make sense of the of breathing soon, but the eating part, that that's always the strange. So yeah, weapons are all busted up again. Wanna save? Yes. Alright. Really? Just a missile? Alright, so yeah, that was, in my opinion, the hardest boss in the game. Now I want to level up my Polar Star first. So now we get the nice chillax area to deal with after the, that fight. Alright. Give, give me the XP. Stop bouncing above my head. It's rude. Alright, let's see here. What else is not level? The missiles? and eh, whatever. They're fine. If I get extra EXP, I'll put the missiles, I guess. But I'm not gonna use them. Really? Really? Just go bounce down to the spikes like that? Anyway, we can swim through infinite amounts of water for now that we have Curly's air tank. And, okay, I thought there was something over here, but there isn't. But, there's shit up there. Get a bunch of hearts, hearts for shooting up here. As well as one more for down here. Back to max life. Oh boy, I might have to grind EXP a bit to get the blade back up. Anyway, let's just go with the water currents. Jump here, otherwise you're going to loop for a bit. Alright, let's just take out all these jellyfish. Trust me, do not go into the water current until you have taken out the jellyfish. It is just a bad idea. Yeah. How do I keep, like, precisely shooting around the jellyfish? Okay, I'm gonna have to go into the current with one alive. There we go, shot up, oh, shit, one more there. So yeah, I think you just need to hold 
jump and you'll eventually... Nope. Come on. Let me... Let me be free of this. Save me. Up here we go. Now we're going up. And you have to hold right to get in here, but be careful. Don't want to go too far right. Jump up here. Get rid of that guy. Thank god I got level 3 blade. And I don't really care about leveling up missiles right now. Waterway cabin. Save. Where's light up the screen? Why don't you take a rest? Okay. She isn't moving, but it looks like she's still alive. Words lie up the screen. You know, I often record what I learned in that notebook. There's a notebook covered in dust. Do you want to open the notebook? Yes. Surface developed robots have limitations on their operation underwater. If they are submerged for too long on a period, their system automatically shuts down to avoid short circuiting. The following is a description of the proper method of caring for a flooded robot. So yeah, that's where it makes sense for breathing. Learned how to treat flooded robots. When a robot has been tried via the aforementioned procedures, the system will automatically begin the rebooting process. And nothing of interest in the outer shelf. Okay. Wondering the water for Curly? Yes. Oh, you're alive! Oh, I'm so glad. I didn't think we were going to make it. Once you fell unconscious, I couldn't think of any other way. Looks like my air tank worked just like I'd hoped. Ah. Uh. Oops, she's back asleep. Appears that it takes some time to reboot. Do you want to leave her here? No. Do not leave her here. Want to save? Yes. So, yeah. Next time, get to take Curly and escape the labyrinth. See you guys then. Goodbye. Peace.